This castle that stood in Fort Mill for decades is coming down. It has been empty for years and a developer offered to level it free of charge. New tonight, we found out why that demolition suddenly stopped. After more than 20 years, the castle in Regent Park came under attack today. Bulldozers started ripping the grounds apart. My wife prays here every morning and she was sad this morning. We thought it was an icon and that because of why because of what it represented, it might, would have been nice for it to stay there. Clearly, the community had grown attached to the structure in Fort Mill, once a part of Heritage USA, and later a water park attracting visitors from all over the country. But current owner Morningstar Ministries said it became clear the best option was to tear it down and build something new. It's the people who see this and are concerned about it. Give us ideas. We're open and, and we want to do something there that the whole community would feel free to come out and enjoy. Late this afternoon, York County officials abruptly stopped the demolition, saying the health department had no record of a permit for work to destroy the landmark. Even though it's run down a little bit, like with a new paint job and just uh, a little tender love and care, it could have been awesome. <laughs> Work to erase what's left can continue once the proper paperwork is in hand. Progress is progress, you know, but uh, I suppose this is progress. I mean, the church doesn't have to pay for it, so that's a good thing. And uh, hopefully it's a win-win for everybody.